everyone! Welcome back to the channel! Today, I have this little beauty from my garden. And I'm gonna be doing something with him I've actually never done before! So let's get started! I'm gonna have my usual, a scoop, pumpkin carving tools, exacto blade, tea lights, knife, a bowl, something to put the seeds in, and a washable marker I've had probably since my childhood. With my pumpkin carving tools, I got actually some patterns for pumpkin faces, and I've actually never used one. So I'm gonna do that now. Pick a face. Pick which side of the pumpkin I think will be best for the face. Remove the inserts and rip it immediately. So you have to pick another face. Once you get all the pieces punched out, tape them on your pumpkin lightly just to see where about each should fit. The pumpkin's pretty small compared to the face, so I'm gonna have to do a little bit of adjusting. And take your knife and cut and hollow out your pumpkin. Seeds! This one had a lot of seeds. Seeds form in clumps, so when you stick your hand into the pumpkin, find a cluster of seeds, pinch them between your fingers, and simply pull the whole handful out at once. Then take your scooper duper whooper thing and start scooping out your pumpkin guts. Give it a little wipe down, put your top back on, and then take your tape and your pattern and stick it on your pumpkin. It's not completely flat, so you're gonna have to like pinch and pull some of the corners of the paper to make it fit properly. Go in with your washable marker and trace everything out. Ta-da! Then go in with your carving tools and carve away. I find marshmallow marker is so much easier to work with because you don't have to worry about scratching off the ink later. Take a knife or a sharp blade, something smaller, and cut out the backs of your carvings to let more light through. Do be careful! Oh, isn't he cute? And we're done!
and with a real candle. I love his little fangs! <laughs> Pumpkin face, but there's nothing wrong with that. That is adorable. That is adorable and perfect in every way. Oh, I'm just so happy. Uh, <laughs> I think if I do this pattern again, it's gonna be on like a little bigger pumpkin, so I can lay the face out a little flatter. But I don't know. I think it's great. I'm so happy how he turned out. He's just so cute. Oh, I love him so much. I can't wait to make the next one. That's it for me. See you next week. Bye.